Legos have taken over here at Exploration Place. My kids loved playing with Legos growing up. But what are some other construction toys that kids would like to build with? After searching the shelves at the Explore store, I found three great items. So let me tell you a little bit about these techno tiles, which are pretty cool. So if you know what a magna tile is, these are similar except they're non-magnetic. So they are held together by little connectors. Everything comes in the kit, whether you're getting a dinosaur, like a prefab kit, you can make your own dinosaur, or you can make your own um, unicorn, or you get one where it's a little more open-ended, and you get to create whatever your imagination comes up with. You're gonna get all the pieces for it, and including stickers in these two pieces right here to help bring your, um, your constructed piece together, put a little more life in it. So we here, we have a dinosaur. And he was pretty simple to put together. The pieces simply click on, and you get to take these basic geometric shapes and turn them into something very imaginative and creative and fun. And your kids, um, when they're putting these together, uh, get to use their STEM abilities and learn about construction and engineering and geometry all in the process of playing. If you like Legos, this is another way to practice your STEM skills uh, with a different type of tool. Kiva is maple planks. They're 100% natural, which I like, and they're American made, which I also like, and they're used in lots and lots of places. You can come up with uh, large structures like this. This is, uh, was made by one of our wonderful VSAs who's worked here for a long time, and he made this very interesting castle coordinated set here. We have the castle itself. He put in a small fort, uh, or you could look at it as a stable for the horses. We have a tree. He got very creative and he glued it together so it's permanent now. Um, and he's a little bit more advanced in his building skills, but we also have Kiva for juniors, something for the younger people, um, four years and up in this particular set. But with Kiva, all you really need is gravity and imagination, and you can come up with wonderful buildings and monuments. And Kiva is also something that is used in a lot of educational institutions, such as schools and libraries and museums like Exploration Place. If you really want to get detailed and intricate in your building, Metal Earth, which has been around quite a while, is probably a good direction to go. And I've never opened a package of these before, but here I am. I'm going to open it up and we're going to see what's inside. So we have a plate here of laser cut steel pieces and directions on how to build. In this case, we've got one done, and this is the Apollo lunar module, already put together in all its glory. And it is put together by taking these uh, steel pieces and bending tabs to hold them together. So before you even think about getting into Metal Earth, it might be a good idea to get yourself a nice tool kit that has some tweezers, needle nose pliers, um, it may be uh, something that will assist you in bending the tabs over, and a magnifying glass because that is pretty small. <laughs> and if you're older like me, <laughs> that would be hard to do. But they come in all kinds of kits, whether your child is into Harry Potter and dragons, and I like these because they're in color, or traditional, uh, maybe dinosaurs like we have here. And then there are, of course, many options as far as what kind of styles. We've got cars and spaceships and even um, wonderful places on Earth like the Leaning Tower of Pisa or the Bridge in London and places like that. So it's a challenging way to develop your STEM skills and maybe for a child who's 14 and up, this would be a good way to go. So we've been talking about some great products for the young or older builder in your life, but sometimes there's no substitute for a classic. We have Legos in the Explore store right now. So come get them while you can, because it'll be for a limited time. And remember, when you visit, you don't have to see the exhibits if you don't have time, or if you just want to come in and pop in and buy some Legos, or any other one of our wonderful products, you can do that.